Uh, joining us this morning, D.A. Davidson analyst Michael Baker is a target of 181 and a buy on the stock. Michael, it's great to have you back. Um, to the degree that they mentioned deflation uh, and managing that uh, in the coming months, according to the call, is that a liability for margin if, in fact, inflation was positive for margin in the past? Well, I think in a way it could help because uh, if we do see deflation, uh, particularly in some of the food areas, uh, couldn't that lead to some crowding in rather than crowding out of some discretionary purchases? A year ago, you had so much inflation in the basic uh, categories that a lot of the discretionary items were crowded out. The reverse could happen. In other words, you could invite in more general merchandise sales, uh, which would be positive for margins. So deflation, yeah, that can hurt uh, the dollars, but units uh, should get better. And, and in fact, again, those units could get better in, in, the, uh, in the more discretionary areas. Between Walmart and Target, who would be better poised to take advantage of that scenario? Well, you know, Walmart, we think. Uh, Walmart is still taking market share. Uh, you know, Target could see a little bit uh, of an inflection point, I suppose, and be less negative in, in that environment. But we still think Walmart is taking share relative to Target. Now, of course, Target stock worked better yesterday. A lot of that is due to valuation and, and expectations. Uh, but, but we still think Walmart is the share, you know, gainer in, in this environment. What are we learning about consumer discretionary trends because it, it still feels like you know if, at first we were wondering if they bottomed if we were seeing some goods I think the target CFO did talk about better trends in apparel and home for instance but wh when can we actually factor in a recovery or is that just too far with the trends worsening on the macro level yeah, you know, you said it earlier. I think you said it right. We are seeing a slowdown, uh, and, and we're seeing that in a lot of the data points. To me, it feels a little bit like a, a soft landing. Um, things are slowing a little bit. Discretionary, uh, the, the basic goods are still, you know, doing better than discretionary. Although I think discretionary could catch up a, a little bit. But again, it does. We are seeing a slowdown. No, November was a little bit better. The end of October worse. In, in a lot of ways, I think that's weather. Uh, simple as that. You know, it was really warm towards the end of October. November has gotten cooler, and, and people are buying some 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 colder weather apparel. But I, I think this generally does uh, all the data points we're seeing, including the retail sales yesterday, does point to uh, slowing sales. We think it'll be a modest holiday season. Again, that's consistent to us with the soft landing.